Beautiful people, welcome back to yet another fantabulous episode of the Ignite Your Purpose show, vlogcast, vlogcast, podcast, um, where we daily, we talk daily about longevity through a healthy lifestyle. It's a mix of the spiritual, mental, mental and physical knowledge, the mind-body-soul trifecta, something we do simply every day, is trying to be better than the day before, baby. On that note, Longevity, longevity, longevity. I've been preaching it for the last little while. <clears throat> I truly believe, and I, I know a gentleman out of New York, a trends forecaster. Actually, two of them. Uh, one's my friend. Another one is a big dog. His name is Gerald Salente. He is forecasting, has forecasted that longevity. Going into the future, our longevity is going to be one of the growth industries. So we hope definitely that Ignite Your Purpose is the tip of the iceberg for that. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Okay. On that note, longevity. Today I've been talking to a, a gentleman I've been working out with um, every time I come down here. Met him a couple of years ago, actually. We will have him on the show, Mr. Howie. Um, and I'm checking him out today, and he has a, a whole side business, right? Now let's talk about age. Let's talk about how um, culture goes, all right? And then we're going to talk about the Ignite Your Purpose style. So... The talk's going to be basically this, beautiful people. You don't quit after a certain age, all right? You just don't. If you have it in you to keep going, keep friggin' going. And this is what I love about this. All right, got to get to the point. Um, my man, he's, he's on the island of Maui. He's working. He's made his bank, man. He's a, he's a big boy. He's, he's doing his thing. He's got, he's got everything. He's got the family living here with him. He's, he's living the damn dream. He's an amazing gentleman. Started CrossFit, I think, maybe a year and a half ago something around that, maybe more, maybe a little less in that area somewhere. Uh, and I get to talking to him today, he hit me up on Instagram and boom, I see fitover60.com. Fitover60.com. Here's a gentleman who doesn't need to work, doesn't need to start a side hustle, but has done it himself, sees the benefits, sees the gap in the demographic, right? and goes forward and goes forth and starts something else and at his age wants to hustle it and make it better. This, again, along with my yesterday's talk, my day before is that talk, talking about everything coming up in 2019, all the amazing things that are actually happening, even though we might think that there's some bad because there's a lot more bad being reported all the time, this blew my mind. I was so pumped because I am so used to hearing, dude, when you hit 30, it's over. Man, you're 35, it's over. Oh, once you hit 40, backside of death is coming. 50, oh, you might as well give up. You'll, you'll be fat and slow and it's over. 55, you know what I mean? Like, that's all I ever hear. However, I, like I would say, I work out with certain people that blow my mind at certain age. It is such a small percentage. It truly is a small percentage. But if people like him, and there's many others out there, right? Small percentage, but there is many others out there continue doing this, continuing to continue to educate and show people that are, Hey, guess what? At 30, dude, look what I look like at 35. Look what I look like at 40, look what 50. Look what I look like. He's in his sixties. The guy is killing it now. All right. He came in not so great. Probably. I don't, I didn't meet him his first day, but I see what he's doing now, man. He's a ball of energy. He's hilarious. I said to him the other day, I'm like, bro, man, since I was here, so I was here six months ago. I mean, he's got defined arms now, man. The brother is doing so good. I'm so happy for him. I'm so proud of him. And it shows to all the others in that age category. Whatever your niche, whatever your age category is, whatever your demographic, whatever your name, creed, nationality, color, man, we can be better. We can do better if we just start putting better foods, start having better thoughts, and start moving around. It is that simple, beautiful people. And I was pumped. I was honestly pumped for somebody to break the trend, right? Because by that age, you're thinking, I'm going to shut her down, I'm going to retire, I'm going to drink, I'm going to eat, I'm going to do what I want, and I'm going to get big and slower and whatever. But that's a, sorry, that's a bit of a broad generalization there, but you know how the trend goes. It, it's, it's actually even studied. We read a study on this uh, maybe three days ago, him and I, on you know X amount of years. There's a pretty high percentage that X amount of years after we retire, we die. How friggin' sad is that? I don't know if it's because I can't remember right now. I just came off the top of my head. I don't have that written down. The demographic, uh, the story, the um, the actual numbers, but maybe it's because you don't have a purpose anymore, or maybe it's you miss the routine. 
you know, maybe you're just bored out of your tree and you eat too much. I don't know. Or drink yourself to death. I'm not sure. But let's break these trends. 2019, man, 2020, it's going to be off the charts. Longevity is the way. If you're older, stick with us. I mean, if you're in your 50s, in your 60s, in your 70s, sky is the limit, man. CrossFit is, is also into this big time. They're switching up their whole game plan. Um, people. 80 is the new 60, 60 is the new 40, something like that. Let's do this. As always, I thank you. If you are up there in age, it is not over. Remember that. It is not over. you got a lot of life to live. We're going to be living longer, so 60 might only be midlife now, right? Could be. So on that note, hope that you join us uh, tomorrow because we're here every day, all day. The podcast is blowing up. I'm so thankful for that. I'm so grateful for that. Um, and on that note, I'm out. Talk to you tomorrow. Let's be better. Let's do better. Join a club. I don't care what kind of club it is, as long as you're moving, starting to think better and eat better. Bye-bye.